Hello there everybody, this is Marvel Vivian 13 here, and welcome back to Stupid Invaders. And for right now, we got Candy. And she's gonna need to find her way out. Unless she, we just got her out of Nelson. That weird Easter Bunny. Okay, so next, I know we gotta go into the submarine over here. Okay, now we're good. Now we gotta go over here and get that fish, that, oh. That's an opera singing fish. Come on over here. Yeah, that's it. Can you just fish wrestle? Freak, yeah. Okay, now we got the fish. Uh, okay, this one over here does the periscope. Um, okay. A right lever would be used for making this window crack. I don't think there's nothing I could do with the controls. Not at this time, I think. If it right now we gotta go back on the back on the water. Okay, next we gotta go over here. That's strange. I was just thinking to myself, that fish tank has to be large enough to carry something. Other than a submarine, but still. You would need to have like a submarine in a fish tank that size to feed a really big fish. So I'm thinking I'm going to have to get Candy to dive underwater without the diving suit. Poison fish! I'm sorry, Susha. But aliens can I mean, space aliens cannot be discovered by the likes of you. Look at Candy being all MacGyver, hooking up that gas cylinder to the stove by using a vacuum tube. Okay, and next, we gotta go over here and go to the stove. Okay, and go do that. And it looks like she made a can. I'm not sure what that is, but I think it's very... Oh, wait a minute, it must be very important. I think it's used for the cow to make hot, fresh dung. And so right now, let's go ahead and see if we can go underwater. You know... I'm gonna go ahead and save it from here. I'm gonna save it under this one. There we go, and let's go. I'm hoping that if I go underwater, I might be able to see whatever is there. Like a, a shark of some kind or something, I don't know. Let's go ahead and try. I couldn't possibly go swimming without my bikini. Uh, a bikini? Did you just say bikini to me? He just, she just said bikini. Okay, um... Okay, so he just knocked out that chef guy. We gotta go over here and grab this bucket. I'm not sure what the use is the bucket for anyway. Um... Let's see. Something in the... Huh. 
Huh. Let me think. Huh. Oh, wait a minute. Let's see here. I think... I don't understand that. Um, I do believe that... Maybe we could not... Uh, maybe I gotta toss that can into the water. Perhaps a shark would eat it. Huh. Maybe it's going go back underwater. Yeah, just one last time. Just look underwater in case there's things I need to get. Yeah, candy is strong for using that diving suit. Okay. Okay, let's go ahead and go this way. That's strange. So is this fish tank? I think there is something here. Oh, we all live in the yellow submarine. <laughs> Alright. Okay, we gotta go ahead and use the periscope. Maybe there's something I haven't seen on the periscope yet. Down periscope! Just want to make sure. Oh, nothing here. Maybe I gotta grab the periscope? No, it looks like there's no other side actions. Okay. Um. Oh, wait a minute. Maybe I needed to grab some of that water from that fish tank? Yeah, maybe so, because I'm like, I got a bucket for a reason. Yeah, maybe I gotta go over here and grab some of this here water. Huh. No? I thought it was special water for the fish to be surviving inside a submarine. Oh, wait a minute, it's Steve the Diver, maybe? Oh, of course, maybe, why in the world did I not thought of that? I gotta use the plastic... I mean, I got to... Use this on the, on the diver, no? Use this on this? No? Maybe use this on the diver? No? Maybe use that? No? I can't do anything with this. Not yet, anyway. There must be a spot in this place I haven't looked yet. What in the world could... What in the world could be here? Yeah, I gotta go up to the submarine. Nothing here? Huh, nothing in here. Man. Okay, so it looks like I don't think anything else I need to do in here. Nope. Huh. Okay, I think I can see something there on that table. 
Maybe, uh, maybe there's something here in the toilet that I need to get? Come on, I don't see anything here in the toilet I need to get. Nope. Huh. Maybe, maybe there's something in the fish tank I need to look at? From the outside? Nothing here on this here thing? Huh. Okay, give me one moment while I go ahead and check to see if I know what I'm doing. Okay, I'm back. I think I know what to do now. Okay, here we go. Can I press this button? Okay, let's be on my way. It looks like I looked everywhere in this floor, so it looks like I gotta head on to button number two. We're I mean, talking about the craziest hoe down ever. And now look at this. Look at this thing over here. It is poor safety codes written all over it. No railings. No support struts. See? It was a safety hazard just waiting to be happened. Okay, I, I might need to save the game from here, but that's just because that... Uh, there was a crash that happened to me one time when I did a practice run. So I'm going to go ahead and see her from here, and it's going to be this one. There we go. Let's go ahead and open this up. And I'm hopeful this will not crash on me. Okay, here we go. Okay, good. It didn't crash on me. <laughs> look at see, look at Candy. <laughs> she's like a freaking gum. She's like a character from Gumby, like Gumby's sister or something. <laughs> oh man! It looks like we're gonna be playing Limbo underneath the Iron Curtain. Okay, we made it. Okay. Yep, we got the bucket and we got the can of chili. And yes, I looked at that thing wrong knowing that I was looking at the can of chili. It's almost like we gotta head on over to the elevator, which I, I am trying to figure out. Nope. Okay, it looks like it only wants me to go downstairs. I don't see anything else here I'm gonna need. Nope. Let's head on downstairs. Okay. May as well save it from here again. Save it onto this one. Just in case it crashes again. You know what I mean. Just in case it crashes and I'm gonna have to start that thing all over. Uh-oh. There's a human around here. Uh, let's see here. Let's go do this. We're smashing him with the lever. Okay, now we got some dumb transportation. I can't leave without the cow poo poo. Okay. We can't leave without the cow poo poo, which means we're gonna have to let Gorgeous in. Okay, so that means that. You should be this one. You should be this door. You gotta go over here. 
I think it's this door here. Oh, that just leading me back into the kitchen. Oh. Okay, I know Gorgeous has to be around here somewhere. Well, let's see. Should be this one. Yeah, I think I remember this. Go up here. Oh, that must be where they were gorgeous and candy leaves for the cow dung. Nope. Okay, so it looks like that is the, the ramp, the off ramp or something like that for candy to leave. I mean, candy and gorgeous to leave. So I think, oh, this must be the button for gorgeous. Oh, yeah. We got the cow, see? We got the chili. Oh no. It's cow it's cowzilla. Come on, baby. Put your weight into it. Give us the goods. Come on. Bake a hot one for daddy. How uncivilized. I never do it on the ground. Oh, please. Uh okay. Bucket on the cow to get that hot, fresh dung. He was peeking. He was peeking. Ew, man. That nearly made me puke. <laughs> because of all that dung. <laughs> Excellent work, Candy and Gorgeous. Thanks to you, we'll be able to get out of here. Very well, and not a second too soon. As my father always said, patience is a liability. Your father was full of crap. Come on, get in the car, Marge. I don't know. What in the world is he talking about? Is he talking about Marge Simpson? Oh. Man, one one little gas cylinder. Oh, for oh yeah. I was about to say one little gas cylinder. I mean, a little gas leak can actually do that, but then I realized they were in the dung factory, and dung is a... Is like methane gas. That's explosive. Area fifty-two. Us <laughs> Very interesting. Area fifty. Up, we're almost there. <laughs> Area 52, which is Area 51's older brother. Because 52 is better than 51. Boy, the architect who designed this must have had a serious Oedipus complex. Oedipus? What the frick is an Oedipus complex? I definitely gotta take a look into that. Oh, and that ship. That is so wrong. To me, that looks like something that I should not say over a video. <laughs> Greetings, my friends. Science will need you. Welcome to the Club Med of Death. Here's the program for the day. We are going to take you to your bungalows and you will relax. Before their fun begins, then Professor Igor will use you for guinea pigs. <laughs> <laughs> On thanks to your brains, we will have access to the UFO technology. Oh, say, Doctor, in your clinic, do you perform, oh, how can I put it, um, uh, operations to uh, change one's sex? Shut your mouth. 
Boss, when I talk to you, you're pretty fine. Boss, take away these creatures from outer space. What do you want? Uh, the other half. The other half? The ah, yeah, right, good. What was I thinking? Uh, a job well done deserves payment. Igor! Give the other half to Meister Bulak. Bulak. <laughs> he is indeed evil. And I will kill him. Or kick his butt or something. We got butt. Candy. Oh, that's accurate. It really is well done. I must schedule an appointment for next Thursday. <laughs> that Zachary is really a slime ball. Next time I see him, he's going to regret the day he was hatched. The alien space alien is supposed to be curious of the button. Whoa. Okay, so it looks like I'm gonna go ahead and save the game from here, then I'm gonna go ahead and do my sign off. Okay, here we go. And we'll be playing as stereo now, it looks like. And this will be fun. And I hope that you all had a good time. And I'll see you all again next time. This is Marvel Living 13 signing off, and I hope that you all have a nice day.